Historically, Samsung has used two distinct chipsets for its Galaxy S flagship series. In markets such as the US, Canada, and China, the phones were powered by a Qualcomm Snapdragon system on chip SOC, while in all other regions the phones were equipped with the latest in-house developed Exynos chipset. The only exception to this was in 2015 when concerns over overheating issues with the Snapdragon 810 led Samsung to use the same Exynos chip across all Galaxy S6 series models. This year, Samsung equipped all Galaxy S23 series handsets with a powerful Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 chipset, and this could be the case for the foreseeable future. A Twitter tipster with the name Connor, who Sam Mobile says has no better than an average track record, states that next year's Galaxy S24 line will not use an Exynos chip, which means that the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 SOC will likely be employed. We've already seen two tipsters disseminate two different specs for this SOC, and the only thing that both tipsters agree on is that the chip will be produced by TSMC using its 4 nanometer process node. One of the tipsters, RG Clouds, says to expect the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 to use a 1 to 4 3 configuration with one high performance Cortex X4 CPU core running at a speed of 3.70 GHz, a 15% height from the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2's 3.20 GHz speed for its X3 high performance core. It's worth noting that the Galaxy S23 series is powered by the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 for Galaxy SoC featuring an overclocked X3 core running at 3.36 GHz. The upcoming Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 will also have four high-performance cores and three energy-efficient cores. According to another source, Rivegnus, the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 is expected to utilize a 1 to 5 2 configuration, including a powerful Cortex-X4 core running at 3.20 GHz, in contrast to the 3.70 GHz predicted by RG Cloudus, Five Cortex A720 performance cores operating at 3.0 GHz and two Cortex A520 efficiency cores operating at 2.0 GHz. This tipster has gone into more detail, suggesting that the chipset will feature the Adreno 750 GPU, the Snapdragon X75 5G modem, with a 20% improvement in energy efficiency, and support for LPDDR5 RAM with universal flash storage, UFS. 4.1. While it remains unclear which Tipster's predictions are the most accurate for the upcoming Snapdragon 8 Gen 3, anticipated to launch a month earlier in October this year, it appears that Samsung will not be incorporating an Exynos chipset in its Galaxy S24 series. Samsung is said to be developing a new Exynos chipset that employs ARM's Cortex CPU cores, but is unlikely to be ready in time for next year's flagship lineup. If it does materialize, it may instead debut with the Galaxy S25 series in 2025, if at all. After all, a new Exynos chip is a rumor blowing in the wind. For the moment, there is no reason for Samsung to even think about straying from Qualcomm for the Galaxy S line. If you enjoyed the video, subscribing to the channel would be greatly appreciated. That's it for today. What's your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comment section. As always, see you in the next video. Peace out.